hi guys what's up hope you're all doing great and in this video we shall just start creating an app for our restaurant and the ui what we will be developing would be having a list of food items and their description the ui will be looking something like this so this is the ui we will be developing in this video and before getting started with the coding part i would like to give a brief i would like to just discuss regarding the widgets what i have used to have a good overview of what we'll be developing in the later part okay mm, i have just used cards basically uh, and inside those cards i'll be wrapping the description of the food items and the image so the card will be inside a list view so that we will be having a scrollable option and the image what you see on the right side of the food item is fitted into that part using the fit bo fitted box widget in the flutter and the description on the left side is nothing but a column that contains multiple lines or the widgets that it is the text widget and the ratings is nothing but the star icon what i have used for now and the tags tags for that image is nothing but the container with the round rectangular borders and i have been giving the color for that container that's it so it would be nice for you to have a brief discussion of how the widget is built and what is the hierarchy it will be easy to get started with the coding so let's now just dive into the coding part so uh, now i have just made initial setup i have just created a stateless widget class which calls the stateful widget class and i have used the app bar with the text as restaurant okay now let's just start building the ui first inside the scaffold we shall have a body which takes first let me wrap all those inside a padding so that i will be having uh, equal spacing on both the sides not both the sides, on all sides so i will be giving a pixel value of 16 will be greater which will be 5 so and 5 pixel value on all top right bottom left later then we'll be giving a child for that padding which takes the list view i said before we'll be using the list view within which we'll be having the cards and for that list view you can give the scrollable option uh, for this i will be using the scrollable as vertical you can also give it as horizontal to have a horizontal scrollable view so for good looking ui i will be giving the scrollable direction as axis dot vertical all right and that later that we shall have children widget okay have a children widget within which we will be giving or we will be first let me give the fitted box because i just want all those to be have a embossing you are looking and with the box take the child which is the card itself and inside that card for card to so what's that this is careful and thing we just need to have another one okay all right i need it and the card just need to have a rounded shape rounded borders so i will be giving the shape as rounded rectangular border with the border radius golden border radius dot circular with a value of 15 all right and after that shape and does that and yeah. after that let me give the elevation 
so that we have a shadow like effect for that car widget all right next let us have a child for the card which is a row because we will be having a description as well as the image so it is a row wise manner and the row takes the children widget okay align it inside that let me um, so this is nothing but a custom function that returns the widget we will be just developing this function later on so just hold it for now this is this function just holds the description of the food items okay and let's just concentrate on the image on the right side first so the image will be inside a container first let me give the width for the container which is a 90 and height i am giving this value for my looking you can just change it for your wish and uh, the container takes the child widget which is the clip or rect here it says it is nothing but i just want that image actually the image is a square square soft borders i just i just don't want that soft borders i just want something smooth or curve so i will be using clip or rect with border radius as same as that of the container so border radius the circular with the value of 15 what i have given for that card so then it will be somewhat matching okay just align it after that let me give the child for that which is the image itself okay inside that image let me fit that image with box fit here i'll be using box fit dot cover and let me give the alignment as alignment dot top right yeah. so after the alignment let me give the source for that image which is the assert image with the path as all right now we have just created a card with an image on the uh, trailing that is the top right or at the right hand side now we just need to focus on developing this description the custom function so let's just start developing that one This function returns a widget, so the return type must be a widget function name. And okay, this returns a container, right? Inside that container is what we will be having all those stuffs. Okay, inside that container, the container has a child which is the column. As I said before, we will be having column like arrangements the column as usual take the children widget and before that let me give the cross axis alignment i just want all those stuffs to be in the center so just want the cross axis alignment dot center and inside that children widget let me first have a padding just take the padding with edge inserts dot symmetrical and uh, i'll be giving horizontal values just the left and right to be of uh, five pixels and align it later that let me give the child for that Let's take the text widget and this text is what you will be describing that food item first 
that cake for that cake uh, image let me give it as Italian charcoal cake just a name and you can just apply style for the text widget using the text style with which I will be giving the font colon font by dot right format font by dot bold sorry bold okay align it and you can also give the font size as let me give it uh, 15 and color dot red all right i just created a text widget which describes the food item name and get rid of the padding also just give a sized box with the height value of 5 just want to have a spacing between each and every line text widget and I just give it as 5 for now later that I'll be having the second line is nothing but the brief a small brief description or description of what the food item actually is so the text is the description of that uh, you can just give anything Belgium just for the sake of the name I'm just giving so I can just give what you want and uh, can just apply style for that test widget as usual and just no need to the time just copy it and just can just paste it okay align it and what just get changed is that I just don't want that to be a bold one and uh, font size let me give it as smaller than that 9.5 would be good and color I don't want red and let me give it as gray align it so we have just given the name for that food item and a brief dis dis description of what the food item actually is and later that text widget as usual just want the spacing again the height value all right that is that is what we will be developing or we will be building that tag for that food item okay so the tag we have just wrapped those inside a row row widget because it will be placed one next to the other so the star rating as well as the tags will be wrapped inside a row widget for your information and the row widget take the children widget as icon constant shopping cart just for the shape of filling that I am just giving it just leave it for if you need size is 15 okay just for a uh, uh, procedural view later that icon as usual here we'll be again giving the size box with the change in not the width it's the not the height it's the width sorry because it is in the row so we will be giving that with value as 5 pixels all right and later that we'll be having a container the container let me give the width for the container which is a 35 pixel and decoration as box decoration within which i'll be giving the color so what is this right 
so mismatching the braces okay so the decoration takes the color let me give the color first which is colors dot light blue with 100 all right and i'll be giving the border radius because i just want that to be somewhat rounded edge don't want that sharp edge so border radius here it is border radius dot circular with the value of 10 okay then after that box decoration let me align that text what the text i'm going to give inside to be in the center so i'm just giving the alignment as center i just want all the text the text i'm going to give inside that tag the container should be the center now you take the child which is the text widget what the tag actually so for that cake let me give it a scold and you can apply style uh, using the text style right sure colon font weight font weight dot bold and font size as something 9.5 as okay now we have just created a text widget with a ta single tag and you just give a spacing just a width space and again you can just copy this tag if you want another tag you can just copy it and just paste it below with changing the tag name fresh cake with color you can give it as somewhat red okay red of 100 values and all other things are the same now let's just get rid of this row okay after this let me give the size box we are in the next line actually so size box the height of 5 pixel values later that we will be giving the ratings so the um, star widget not widget star icons actually now we will be developing that one okay so the row take the children widget just give commas align it now we are just in the middle of the app completion main axis alignment sorry we just need to give it before the children main axis alignment colon main axis alignment dot start which is start okay and inside that children widget we shall give a text which is nothing but the ratings with just a style just copy it the same this is a minor changes okay the style as font weight we just no need for that bold just give it as normal and font weight as something lesser than that previous one so the rating should be somewhat lesser than that of the tag size okay so that i am giving seven and color value color as colors dot gray all right line it so the rating after that rating we shall be having a sized box as we are inside a row will be giving width value all right next is what the icons for that ratings icon of icons dot star star and the size what i'm going to give is 10 and color is important 
colors dot orange accent nice we have just created a single star rating i just want to give it a five star rating okay i just given five stars which is aligned in a row wise manner all right align it now we have just ended up with the creation of a single card which describes the food items on the left and the image on the right you can just copy and paste those previous these things to any number of times you need so i just don't want to bore you with that i will be sharing the code so you can get that code in the description below can you just have it for your reference and for the black theme you can just change this as dark then you will be having a dark theme for your app i have just just have a brief disc discussion about what the dark theme in the previous video so you can if you haven't seen just check out the link in the top and if you haven't subscribed kindly by subscribe to my channel so that you will be getting the latest update regarding this app completion so thanks guys thanks for watching stay tuned have a good day bye